Well, it's a federal trial that is getting a lot of attention in Minnesota. A former GOP donor is on trial for sex trafficking minors. And today, his alleged co-conspirator was on the stand. Fox 9's Rob Olson live for us. So, Rob, what did she have to say? Well, she is uh, still on the stand as I walked out here now. So she has been uh, talking about a lot of different things here. Gisela Castro Medina uh, was charged initially as a co-conspirator with Anton Lazaro and pled guilty in December. This is a key witness for the prosecution as she detailed how she met Lazaro, how she said she became his recruiter, how she got paid, how other girls got paid in this, and then eventually how she was paid to maintain her silence. 21-year-old Gisela Castro Medina testified she had sex with Tony Lazaro when she was 18 for money that she would not have if not for the money. Soon, she said, he asked her to find other girls, preferably 16, petite and white, that he would pay them and her. At first, she said she told him, no, I was freaked out, she testified, but soon he convinced her. The prosecution showed multiple screen captures of Snapchat messages she sent to other girls recruiting. I never mentioned having sex with him, but I would mention he's a sugar daddy. I think most people are familiar with what a sugar daddy is and what they do. She said Lazaro paid her in cash and supplied her with a steady stream of Adderall that she was heavily addicted, said he quickly became her entire world. She began trying to recruit other recruiters. After search warrants were served at Lazaro's Minneapolis condo in December of 2020 and an interview with investigators, he became very nervous. He kept telling me that it went bad, and he said he would, in exchange for my silence, he would buy me a house and pay for future grad school, anything. Prosecutors detailed the money trail that followed, 11000 in cash so she could buy a car, 5000 to pay her college tuition, began paying her $650 a month rent. She spent 10000 on his credit card, and she got got at least 10,000 in cash to keep me happy, to silence me, to recruit, she said. The final question from the prosecutor, very simply, what was her role? My role in the conspiracy was to find Anton Lazaro girls to have sex with, and in return, he would pay for it. The defense attorney then uh, is still doing cross-examination as I walked out here, really kind of taking aim at her plea deal with federal prosecutors here and how she had been looking at a significant prison sentence, a life sentence, they suggested, and that her testimony was then therefore uh, compromised uh, by this agreement and by uh, the fear of spending all those years in prison. Um, but again, it's important to point out that the prosecutors showed loads of uh, documents here. Again, many, many screenshots from Snapchat that showed the conversations between her and Lazaro, between her and other girls as well, and uh, documented, too, the money that changed hands. Live in Minneapolis, Rob Olson, Fox 9.